Welcome to today's lab demo. My name is Daniel Seitz, Manager Innovation and Application at our coherent lab in Munich. During the next couple of minutes, I'm going to show you how to align a 3D part with a 2D vision system. I'm going to mark multi-tools that are placed on a tilted surface. The position is then corrected with our automated vision system. For this lab demo, we are using an Exact Mark 210, which is equipped with a 50 watt fiber laser, a fast focusing module, a vision system, and additionally a linear axis. First of all, I place the multi tools loosely inside the pockets of our fixture. Additionally, also the fixture is loose. By default, Laser Framework starts in the job selection, so the operator can easily start production, for example, by scanning a barcode. But now, let me show you how easy it is to set up a recipe and a vision task. First of all, we need to define the recipe flow. And therefore, we go to the recipe flow manager and create a new recipe. On the right side, we have the different process steps and we simply drag and drop them into our process flow. We define an input variable for our name, the vision task, to set up the position correction, the Galvo task that contains our marking layout, and we activate the live view for the operator. To define the 3D marking layout, we enter the Galvo process step and press edit to open Visual Laser Marker, the layout editor. In its 3D view, we load the 3D model and place it according to the position on the fixture. As we want to mark two parts, we also load the second 3D model. After we unwrapped the surface, we attach the marking content to the surface. For this demo, we choose the coherent logo and a name. After this is done, we return to Laser Framework to continue with the vision task and setting up the variable. In the data input process step, we define our variable, in this case, a simple value that we want to input before starting the mark. And we define the name of the variable and also a start value. The final step is now to set up the vision task. After double-clicking on the vision process step, we click on the surface that we unwrapped in the editor and assign the two-point 3D alignment vision task to the surface. The crosshairs define where the camera will look at for aligning the part. We place the crosshairs near prominent features of the workpiece. Double-clicking a crosshair brings us to the setup for the vision task. The already known step-by-step -step wizard guides us through the setup. In the live view, you can already see that the focal plane is automatically extracted from the cut model and we only need to define the illumination and the exposure time of the camera. Continuing to region of interest, we define the area where we want to extract contours for our automatic alignment. After you click on Teach, the software then automatically highlights found contours and you can simply select or deselect them as you desire. Afterwards, you finish the teach process by clicking on teach and starting the test procedure will help you to define how robust the vision process is. The exact same steps we perform for the remaining three crosshairs to set up both multi-tools. Now we are done setting up the recipe. If you want to perform a test run, you can directly press on execute in the recipe editor.
I hope you enjoyed this lab demo that showed you how easy it is to mark a 3D part with a 2D vision system.